this video I'm going to be talking a little bit about the progression update that's coming out this year, hopefully. Sit back, relax. It's not because I'm going to be talking about the updates that are coming to the Wild West, which is a really interesting topic if you ask me. But um, no more yet. Let's get into it. So the Wild West finally updated us about the progression update. So this is what they are saying. Our friend Tyler over at Starburst Studios sat down and typed a little bit of a update about what's going on with the progression update and why it's so delayed. So what's taking so long? They are just a small team working on a huge game. They have also had some problems within the staff team, which they that they have fortunately mostly fixed. So that should be good now. They also said that it's hard to work on Roblox, you know, the game engine. Because Roblox is a game engine. It's not just a game, it's a game engine. Which you can make games on, which is where the Wild West is made. As I've heard, the Roblox game engine accidentally deleted the progression updates for the first time they were working on it. Which probably was really frustrating for them. Here, they're typing. As an example, we've recently been wrapping up a pathfinding service replacement that works the same as Roblox's automatic nav mesh generate. But it's generally faster and doesn't break all the time like Roblox has for us. We were held back the last year pretty much by that alone because one of the big things we're adding to the game are NPCs. I'm really excited for NPCs, I just have to say that. I'm, I'm really excited. They could not use Roblox's pathfinding system because they're going to add so many NPCs. I think and that is going to be hard for Roblox's pathfinding system to understand. I'm not a dev or anything, so I don't really know. Now, let's talk about the progression update. The estimated release date for the progression update is mid-November, which we are in mid-November right now. So I'm really excited. It's about 90% done now. So yeah, that, that's going to be amazing. For this. I'm going to be streaming the progression update live on my Twitch, which is TV slash mango and the rat. They're also going to add a fishing system or a fishing skill. That is going to be amazing for making money because I think uh, we've been mining now for the last five years. So fishing is going to be interesting. I think fishing is also going to have something to do with the progression system. So you're going to have a fishing skill at least that's what they say here in the blog post the fishing update is most likely going to be released in early to mid december they're about 80 percent done with that if you guys want to read this check out the devlog you can find it in the the wild west discord highlands biome now this is going to be so interesting it has been coming soon now for the past few years i'm hyped for it, it it's hopefully going to be a place where people can pvp uninterrupted that's what i hope for at least because the only place we have like that right now is Callan manor and there's usually a lot of people at Callan manor so it's going to be interesting to see it's going to be released about the same time as the fishing update they are also making stage coaches and wagons i hope that you're going to be able to rob those stage coaches because that would be absolutely amazing more realism looking more like the wild west would is always welcome at least for me the building update big update we've been waiting for i think we've been waiting for it for about four years now it is not the main focus um which is hard to see but they are currently working on a lot of different things so that's not too bad i think it's really amazing that they're at least thinking about it right now the release date is unknown so yeah i can't tell you more about that wildlife overhaul they're going to fix the animals and stuff they're going to completely overhaul it completely when i say completely i mean completely overhaul it they're going to also add a, another ai for the animals which is going to be much better and they're going to reintroduce snakes hopefully <laughs> fix the red lag problem snakes used that back all the way back in the day so uh storm studios is also working on the wild seas right now which is probably one of the reasons it's so slow I also want to thank Tyler from Starboard Studios for making this for us creators. It's really, really appreciated. It's, it makes it so much easier to, for me and most other content creators to get more content because we can talk about the updates that are coming to the game. So thank you, Tyler from Starboard Studios for making this. So if you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe, all of that stuff and follow my Twitch twitch.tv slash mango the rat. I'll see you all later. Bye bye.